Good morning children. How are you? We have started 9th chapter children. Okay ma'am? We have seen about the machines. Simple machines and compound machines. What are the new words we have learned children in this chapter? We have seen that. Please open page number 114 children. Page number 114. We have learned about pulley. Pulley means what? A wheel over which a rope or a chain is pulled in order to lift heavy objects. Okay. Next one is screw children. A metallic object similar to a nail with a raised spiral lines around it. The lever a rod or a bar used to lift heavy loads. Axle. A rod passing through the center of the wheel. A rod which is passing that is only known as axle. Incline plane. You will plane up with this in playgrounds also. That only. A sloping plane used to rise or lower a load by rolling or sliding. If you keep the weight here, it will roll or, roll or it will slide children. This is only known as incline plane. Slanting it is. Slanting. Okay. Machines are two types. Simple machines and compound machines. Simple machines won't have many parts and the compound machines will have many parts. What these machines are doing? They are making our work easy, faster and uh, perfect. They are making our work perfect. Olden days, machines were not there. That time it has become difficult to do the works. Whole day they used to spend their time and energy. Before invention of sewing machine, they used to stitch clothes with hands only. Lot of time they used to consume to do that work. Nowadays we got the machines very fast. We are able to stitch our clothes on the machine. Now in this chapter we are going to learn about types of levers. Types of levers. On the basis of the position of load, fulcrum and effort, there are three types of levers children. On what we are basing children? First one, position, position of load, position of load. The next come, fulcrum, fulcrum. Children, fulcrum will be there, children. Here, 
class liver okay children in this what we are seeing the third class liver has the effort in between the fulcrum and the lobe here we are using load is at one end children load is at one end of the object and the support support is another end then when we are putting effort in the center effort effort will be here okay children yeah we are using our effort in the center load will be at the end and fulcrum to another end and effort we are putting in the center see here examples are a fishing rod is an example of third class liver some more examples of third class liver are tweezers and ice guns etc here to hold the high ice to take out the ice from a box he is using tongue ice tongues here is the load and pressure he is putting at the center support is on the other end okay and uh, fishing rod also he is holding his effort is here load is here fulcrum support is here these type of rivers we can see in the third class rivers children okay are you able to follow children only these three are changing children load fulcrum and effort sometimes load will be at the center sometimes load will be at one end sometimes the load will be another end here see load in the first class load is in one end children opposite to that effort is there here load is in the center here also load is in one end effort is in the center they are changing their positions children load effort fulcrum they are changing according to the liver they are changing their position children okay are you able to follow this children okay next turn to page number 120 children in first class liver system effort applied to move the load is in the opposite direction to the movement of the load it is in the opposite direction effort applied to move the load in the opposite direction here effort we are using and it is moving into the opposite direction and <coughs> whereas in the second class liver effort applied to move the load in the same direction to the movement of load here same direction it is moving children it is moving in the op <coughs> opposite direction can you see the picture children here it is moving one side and another side moving in the opposite here same side here also same children okay then in clean plane children you have seen i think uh, slide you will slide na children that only here you can see in clean plane mean slanting slanting between me okay if you keep anything here they roll they fall down easily children this uh, we are calling it as what children in clean plane clean Play. Okay. Now we will see what it will do. You must have seen how gas cylinders, wooden logs, or oil barrels are loaded on trucks and lorries, oil cans, barrels, and cylinders. Big, big wooden logs. How we can't lift them. So what they do, children, if they want to take from one place to another place. what they do they keep everything in the truck or lorry so how they use they use this in their play children and a plank is used for this purpose a wooden plank they keep 
to them. One end of the plank is attached to the body of the lorry or truck, whereas the other end is on the ground. One it will be attached to the ground, another is attached to the to the lorry or truck. This is ground. Okay, one end here, another end. Here. Then this plank act as an inclined plane. Boots are either rolled down or made to slide over the plank, making the work easier. They keep the load here and they allow them to go down. Or if they want to put here, this direction they will put here. They go into the floor like that. Children. Work is made easy with this inclined plane. We find many examples of inclined plane in our daily life. Wheelchair can be can be easily pushed up in the inclined planes in hospitals. Generally, if they have fracture or anything, we will see the easy chair, wheelchair. So that inclined plane in our houses also near the step. Work, Uh, steps we will have that in between. Uh, our vehicles we will use that inclined plane to take inside the house also. Cars and other vehicles would be find it very difficult to go up in the steep road built on the mountains. Okay, children. If the road goes, hence a large distance can be covered in hilly area with winding road. Tirupati like guard roads are there. If they put road straight, it is very difficult for them. So this type of arrangements they will use, and uh, effort will be less. Children, here are the examples. See, inclined plane. They are uh, taking the load inside and outside. Also, they can move and winding the road in the mountains. See here, wheelchair. On this inclined plane, they are taking. On the steps, it is very difficult to go inside. So this is making the the work very easier. Okay, children, take care.